Hey everybody, Arnaldo Wofferman here. This is a Yorkville LS801. Now as you guys know, I have been working on replacing the drivers because every one of these Yorkville LS800 and 801 drivers, the little cap things or whatever, not the caps, I'm sorry, the actual cables that go to the voice coil or the actual cone are pretty much gone. And the reason it does that is because it seems that this cover here or the little uh, insulation, it wears brittle, not even after a year of use and it arcs and it tears apart. I'm tired of doing that. I've got five bad drivers. So what I did is, let me focus over here. What I did is I'm using the Marathon. It's the 18, a PA18500 driver. Now the Marathon18500 driver doesn't quite fit in. It's a little bit wider. So it literally just took about maybe five minutes of sanding this down, uh, but the bolts are, or the holes are pretty much exactly the same. So we put everything in and we're gonna try it out. Five inch voice coil. And when you look at the back, you're like, oh, that's a small ventilation cap. But then when you look through the side, it's got ventilation all the way throughout. This looks like a really nice fat mamma jamma driver. We're gonna go ahead and try it out. Unfortunately, I forgot to bring music. So YouTube it is. We are gonna use, here Billy, grab this. We are gonna use a THX sign suite test. For those of you not familiar. Now. We're just going to go ahead and keep it at quarter in because I don't quite know what's about to happen. Here we go. <coughs> I'm keeping it at 90 degrees. Really nice low rumble. Holy crap. Really low. That's that's pretty damn impressive. Let's go ahead and try it with an actual song. Billy, if you don't mind, Monica, get off that for just a second. That's got some serious vibration. Well, you know what it is is we. It sounds a lot cleaner. Now, of course, it's kind of hard to tell because we are in a uh, really narrow building, but you know I've tested other, the subs in here before and it's hidden. So we're gonna go ahead and. <laughs> So with this, uh, the first thing I noticed is that usually whenever I run a straight or a straight from my phone, even with the 90 hertz cutoff, you still hear a lot of the voices, but I'm not hearing that now. And again, you guys know obviously the driver makes a, a big difference on that. Much punchier, definitely in your face, my ears really hurt. Um, so that's pretty good considering that they've been clogged all day. I think the most impressive part is that the dent that was in here popped back from when it Dented beforehand, so yeah, that's pretty sweet. Uh, again, for those of you guys wondering, this is the Marathon P8 18500. I'm gonna do an AB test this Saturday, and I'll see if I can do a live on Periscope. But I will do one on YouTube as well. As you guys know, I use nothing but my ear to give you that judgment because my clientele is not standing with fancy instruments. They're standing in front, so I want to make sure that it sounds good. I'm not worried about what the meter says. I'm worried about what my ears say. But either way, I will do my best to record it with a good microphone so you can really hear the subtle differences between bass. Again, I apologize for the shaky video. This is something informal. But this is uh, the Yorkville LS801. It's got everything's original on it. Uh, actually, this is the 800. I'm sorry. So this is the 800, and we have replaced it with the Marathon PA18500 driver fantastic driver i will do a full review on that as well thank you guys for watching subscribe to my channel download my mixtape boom